Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. I'd like to welcome you to this wonderful Monday, the 27th of May, 2024. Our topic today on the Seeds of Destiny is Breaking Destiny, destiny Limiting Forces. The Bible says, blotting out the handwriting of ordinances that was against us, which was contrary to us, and took it out of the way, nailing it to his cross. Colossians chapter 2 verse 14, fought for the day. The blood of Jesus is the answer to every ancestral limitation in life. It has been confirmed that a major limiting force of destiny is the force of one's family background. It is the limiting force from one's history or ancestry, and it must be dealt with for destiny to be fulfilled. When God called Gibeon, Gideon, he gave him the instruction to pull down the altar of his father's house in Judges chapter 6 verse 2 verse 25 and that night when Gideon went out he did what God instructed him to do many years ago God's servant prayed for a young man who was stranded nothing was working in his life while he was praying for him he saw a serpent in the revelation and asked him what is this serpent that I see and the young man said his father was a local chief in his community he built a house for a big python every morning the python came out of his house to bow for his father and then returned into the house this demonic python was responsible for the stagnation of this young man's life this young man said he was the first person to become a Christian in his family he was also the first person to become a pastor. Anyone who dared to become anything would be resisted by that python devil. You see, just like this young man, there are many people whose destinies are being resisted by demonic ancestral forces. Whenever they come, they want to move on in life, they encounter a kind of a resistance and stagnation that they cannot explain. Their lives and destinies appear grounded. But we have good news for you today, that the blood of Jesus is the answer to every ancestral limitation in life. God's servant prayed for that young man and the yoke was broken. In the same way, every ancestral force of limitation, resisting your life and destiny is destroyed today in the name of Jesus. You are released to fulfill your destiny in Jesus' name. Amen. Remember this, that the blood of Jesus is the answer to every ancestral limitation in life. What's our assignment today? Number one, make up your mind to prayerfully address the matter of family and generational altars in your life and in your destiny. Number two, use the weapon of the cross, the blood of Jesus and the word of God to pull down any ancestral limiting forces resisting your life and destiny. Praise the Lord. Let's pray. Say, Lord, I thank you for the revelation of your word to me today. I pull down and destroy every limiting altar from my background, limiting my life and destiny today by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. I believe God has heard and answered that prayer and he said for your lifting in the name of Jesus. We're going to go right ahead and I'm going to pray for you. You need to be born again before you can talk about being free from those ancestral limitations. And you want to do that right now, simply pray this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. I know I'm a sinner, I need your help. Please come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away my sins. Make me a new person. From today, I turn my back on sin. I'll live to please you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And I wish you a happy birthday today. It's your special day. As your days are, so shall your strength be. God cause his face to shine on you and be gracious unto you. In Jesus' name, happy birthday and God bless you.